YouTube. You know what time it is. Mighty fan time. And uh, I'm back with another installment of my love for the uh, current Baseball Live series. Of course, the last couple videos I, I showed my favorite team, of course, being the Phillies. And I'm going to continue it on with some other teams uh, staying in the National League in this video. I got five hats to show. And before I do that, I do want to show, I don't think I ever showed this jersey. I have this, uh, I've had this for a couple years now. It's, uh, it's, it's not Mitchell Nets or anything, but it's, uh, it's a um, Majestic Cooperstown collection. Uh, Roberto Clemente Pirates uh, gray, uh, road gray jersey. Um, I know they never had the name or anything on the back, but, you know, I got it a couple years ago at Models. I, you know, uh, Roberto Clemente is probably one of my all-time favorite players in any sport. Uh, even though I never had the pl uh, privilege of actually watching him play, uh, just all the highlights I've watched of him, not just as a player, but as a human being, and what he did, all the charity work he did, and, you know, of course, he died tragically in the plane crash of years ago, delivering goods to earthquake victims. I mean, such a great person, not just a great player. But, of course, he's one of the all-time, all-time players, uh, just great players. In fact, I know some years ago, um, the uh, I, I've never been to the Baseball Hall of Fame in Cooperstown. I hope to go someday, but uh, they did a traveling uh, show where they brought a lot of the artifacts from the Baseball Hall of Fame to city to city, town to town. And Philly, of course, is one of the cities they came in, and um, they were at the Constitution Center, and I went and I saw the show, and one of the things they had there was uh, one of uh, Roberto Clemente's pirate hats. And so that was pretty cool, you know, just to see that. And I think they had one of his gloves, too, so that was pretty cool. That was a lot. That was neat. And it was a great show. I mean, they had, like, the, the 715 home run Hank Aaron Braves jersey and the, a Babe Ruth jersey and Steve Carlton, you know, 1983 powder blue Phillies jersey and stuff, you know, game worn and everything, Jackie Robinson. Just a, a great, great, great collection of stuff. A lot of fun to see. But I do hope someday to get out to Cooperstown and see the Hall of Fame. So there you go. But someday I wouldn't mind getting a Roberto Clemente's Mitchell Ness, the white pullover jersey from the 70s, because that's probably my favorite Roberto Clemente jersey. But every time I go to the first sale at Mitchell Ness, I always see something else. I'm like, ah, uh, you know. So we'll see. Maybe someday I will. But until then, I got this one. And it's still a Clemente jersey, still representing. So there you go. And I got the Pirates hat to go with the jersey. There you go, A-Rock, a little swag there for you. This is the hat they wore with this jersey, um, so there you go. Um, but on, speaking of hats, on to the rest of the hats, the, the hats here that I'm going to show for this video. These are all fitted, these are all New Era, um, and they're actually all the old school New Era with the great underbrim. And I like, I like the older ones, I mean the newer ones are, are pretty good too, like I, well this is, but this. <laughs> The newer ones with the black underbill and stuff, they're okay, but I, I do like these older ones. They just have a little more looseness to them, I guess, but whatever. <laughs> um, but, of course, this is the Chicago Cubs. Um, home away, whatever. I know they also have one with the red brim, but this is, uh, I guess, the classic one that they've had for many, many years. Um, and the Cubs are probably my, 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 my second favorite team in the National League behind the Phillies. Um, just always like them. Not over the Phillies, though. <laughs> Next hat we got is the Cincinnati Reds. This, um, leaves are the hat they wear at home. I know they have a iconic hat that, like, everyone seems to have. It's the black one with the red brim and the red C there. I mean, it, I guess I just noticed these things. Whenever I go out to the mall, there are certain hats that you will always see someone with. One of the, and around here, for, certainly, is the Phillies and the Yankees, but yeah, you always get someone with, with, with that, 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 uh, the black, uh, reds hat with the red brim and the red C. It's a pretty cool hat, but you always see someone with it on. It's like no matter where you go, there's always going to be someone with that reds hat on. It's a cool hat. I may have to pick it up someday, actually. <laughs> but, but don't sleep on this one, because this is a pretty cool one, too. And I also like the old red one, like the classic red with the red brim. But uh, this is, of course, being the red with the black brim hat. 
and uh, that's still a pretty cool red pad. Got it for ten bucks. <laughs> Mitchell and S10, uh, the Super Bowl sale, you know. So wasn't wasn't, wasn't bad of a deal, but um, there it is. It might not be the black red pad with the with the red rim, <laughs> but it's a red pad. <laughs>